Jamie, thank you very much for talking to us. You've just won the FA Cup. How does that feel? It's unbelievable. What a, what a feeling. And do you know what? To do it with a night when everyone but six, six and a half thousand, was it, Leicester fans here with us, the noise they were making, cheering us on, it's, it just makes that feeling even more special. You've done everything now at the football club. You've won the Premier League, you've won the Golden Boot. Where does this rank? Is that an impossible question to answer? No, it's massively up there. Massively up there. I think winning anything, like any trophy, you've, you've got to put it at the top. It's not an easy thing to do. So I think it's testament to the lads with, with the performance that we've put in, attacking together, defending resolutely together, and seeing at the end, everyone's left everything on that pitch, and I think we deserve the win overall. Talk us through the goal from Yuri Tiedemans from your perspective. That has to be one of the finest FA Cup final goals ever scored. Yeah, it's Yuri, isn't it? That's, a, that's what he's there today. <laughs> no, li literally, as soon as he hit it, and. I knew it's, it's got a really good chance and just to watch it fly into that top corner, I think that goal's worthy of winning any game so over the moon for him, over the moon for the club itself and obviously taking that trophy back on. What was it like the last 10 minutes, uh, it was a nervous watch, you could see the fans could barely watch, what was it like to play in? Yeah, no, it, it was, like I said, they were putting a lot of pressure on us but I think you've seen that we've de defended as a team together, defended resolutely and they've got in at the end but for its offside so that's that's telling me that, that we've held our defensive line really well and then like I said to see it out all the way to the end and listening to that full time whistle guys it's just an unbelievable feeling literally just dropped to the floor You've been at the club for a long time you know what the FA Cup means to Leicester having not won it to be part of the squad that's finally got over the line what does that mean to you? That is, like I say it's a brilliant feeling really brilliant feeling we've, we've managed to do it but when the gaffer came in over two years ago, he said he wanted to keep progressing, how he wanted us to play, he wanted us to be challenging for trophies, and now we've got one. We're going to be wanting some more. Yeah, fine. So now it's hard work, dedication, and keep progressing as much as we can. So just finally on, on Brendan then, it's what, two years since he arrived, his impact on the club and, and how important was he in today's FA Cup? Yeah, it was massive. I think you can see with how he's, how he's got us playing, he wants us to play a certain way. And that's exactly what we're doing. Everyone, everyone's bought into it. Everyone's bought into it. And like I said, to keep that progression going is, is testament to himself, what he's working with us on the training field, and, and testament to the lads for, for actually wanting to put the work in. So we'll keep going, like I said, keep progressing as much as we can. And two important games now in the league to look forward to.